Nomad. Send traffic. Looks like there are testing areas in this region. Prototyping and R&D. The Bodarks are sending highly trained engineers to gather intel on the Skell tech in local facilities. Your objective is to kill the Bodark engineers before they can access that intel and escape. Their deaths will prevent the Bodarks from using the region and launching a counterattack against the outcasts. The engineers are scattered and difficult to locate, but you might be able to find them with some well-executed chaos. The Bodarks' communications should indicate where the engineers operate. Find them and kill them. There are several destabilization missions for you. One possibility is sabotaging some factories to prevent the production and use of flying drones. That will lessen security presence in the region. Another option is to destroy the Bodark's VHCs to weaken their air superiority. You can also target the drone shipment in the region to reduce the Ogre drones which protect the engineers. On top of that, you can deactivate the drone swarm that blocks us, and also neutralize the Bodark garrison to weaken them around here. The engineers are the priority. The rest is your call. On it. Nomad out. Drone swarm should be inactive. That'll be easier to fly in this region. Bowman, this is Nomad. Send traffic. This one's tricky, Nomad. The channel's R&D center could contain a ton of claw research. Sam Fisher took care of the threat, but no one should have access to any data left behind. Not itching to have the Bodarks repeat that mess. That place still gives me bad vibes. Weaken the Bodarks with destabilization missions before attacking it. We could use more firepower. The Bodarks have an armored VHC that could serve us well. Claim it for our side. Destroy the enemy VHCs that will reinforce the channel's R&D center. There are many outcast hostages in two locations. Freeing them will strengthen our allies in the region, on the ground or in the air. You need preparation for the final stage of this operation. There are many energy production facilities nearby. Hack the electrical grid and reroute a massive power surge to blow the center's circuitry. That should take care of stored computer data. Then, strip the channel's R&D center of its data and security systems to allow the outcast to seize the place safely. Copy. Nomad out. Now the outcasts will be able to disrupt Bodar traffic in the region. That sniper. Clear. They're gone. Solid work. Nomad. You came. Thank God. Follow me and be careful. There are Bodarks in the area. Those masters are totally fucked up. Lead the way, Ghost. I'll follow. We're attacked! Holy shit. You shot, boss. They were going to kill me. They'll murder anyone that opposes them. They wanted to demonstrate with me. Don't worry. Follow me. I'll get you to safety. Those monsters. They butchered my friends. They'll pay. I promise. Now follow me. I promise you'll be safe. Looks like they're going back to North. Listen, you should know the Bodarks are designing everything in order to incriminate the Russian government. Looks like it. Don't worry. The outcasts will have their boots on the ground in the region. Grenade fire! Smoke them! Eyes on hostile! That takes care of the station's security. Damn! Nice 
Regulator's fried. Nothing will block the power surge now. Grid is linked to the channel's R&D center. Now I just have to get into the channel's R&D center to turn the surge into an EMP bomb. I see a sniper. Bodarks are decrypting claw data. We need to stop them. the search's way to destroy all the computers. The search can be redirected from here. The Bodox Computer servers and security systems. The base is ready for the outcasts. Hmm. 
Bowman, Toad's Nomad. The channel's R&D center is ready for the outcasts. Great. Thank you for helping our zone conquest. We can move to secure the center now that the security system is down. I'll leave you to it. Bowman? Still here, Nomad. The data's been wiped, but there's been a leak. Yeah. You stopped them from harvesting the claw data. But they still managed to extract some other Skeltech research data that could have uncontrolled military consequences. They want to transmit that information onto Russian SVR servers. The same servers that were compromised a few months ago. All the world's spies have eyes on those servers. Their work is sloppy. It's like the Bodarks want Russia to get caught red-handed. Nobody in the intelligence world worth their shit would ignore Russia's illegal involvement in Aroa. Diplomacy between world powers will be damaged beyond repair. We need to stop them transmitting that sensitive data, Nomad. I'll decide how to handle everything once you gather more intel. Roger. I'm out. Nomad, it's Bowman. I got news. The intel you provided uncovered that Warrant Officer Kostas Chertkov is on a disinformation operation. He's an industrial spy and hacker collecting Claw and other Skeltech data. He plans to send everything to compromised Russian SVR servers. Russia's motivations for transmitting questionable data are a mystery, but the results are obvious. The world will see that Russia is now in Aroa looting Skell technology. It could be the first domino in a new Cold War. You need to neutralize Cherkov before he starts transmitting the data. I've deciphered the location for the site of his hacking activity. Copy out. I'll get a better look at the area. Now we can size him up right. There's Chertkov. The military uniform looks like a costume on him. Stay vigilant. There's many hostiles in scam. The, Bodarks too. the only thing you are is a professional liar. Russia will claim all this tech one way or another. And the U.S. will fall by the hand of their own weapons. No idea why you want to start a war between the U.S. and Russia. But it ain't gonna happen under my watch. I'll take him into custody. <laughs> Roman, this is Nomad. Target captured. Data transmission's been shut down. Well done, Nomad. The outcasts are interrogating Cherkov as we speak. They found an audio recording on him. It's a message from the Bodark's leader. Let's see what the bastard has to say. Cherkov, we need you to identify sensitive data and send it to Russian intelligence. The world has to witness the transmission and believe that Russia is responsible for stealing the data. This action should cause chaos in the intelligence. Either this is a clever SVR trick, or Russia isn't behind this. The Mastermind's voice is encrypted, so it can't be easily identified. The recording can't be used to ease tensions either. Chertkov revealed that the whole Bodark operation is a diversion. They're trying to reopen old wounds between the nations, and use the resulting paranoia to deflect from what's really going on in Aroa. But the real scheme is unclear. We need to keep our eyes on them. Copy. Out. <laughs> 